So first what I did, and this is something that you can do if your dog is afraid of doing, of like the vest and whatever. Good morning, internet friends, or rather, good afternoon, internet friends. How are we doing today? Hi, right, boys. We're doing good. How are we, Sassy? I'm doing good. Oh, and check out little boy's collar. It looks so nice. So, what happened today? I got done with work and then came home. And I had a package, and I'm so excited. So the first thing that came in this package is the complete ketogenic diet for beginners. Second thing I was really excited to get, um, if you saw on MRL's Instagram, you know that he got a new vest. Yay, this is from Industrial Puppy, which I've heard is really good. Um, just has the chest strap and the belly thing. It says service dog, but I do have his in training patches. Um, it was an adventure. Oh, it also came with saddlebags. Yay! But it was an adventure. You could tell it's been a long time since I've worked Emerald with a vest. Because he was afraid of that thing. Not that one. Well, he didn't like that one either, but he was afraid of this thing. So, you guys didn't see it. I thought about filming it, but I was already halfway through training. And I wasn't about to stop his concentration then. But, um... I had to work him slowly to somewhat accepting it until he would wear it for about five minutes. So first what I did, and this is something that you can do if your dog is afraid of doing, of like the vest and whatever. First, let the dog sniff it. Just put it on the ground, let them sniff away. I'm gonna sit on my bed with my boys. Hey, Bubby. Hey, Riddler. And then what I did was I put a treat on top of the vest. So he associated, okay. This is a good thing. And then, after a little bit, I would pick up the vest and put a treat on it. And he'd have to get it while I'm holding it. And then after a little bit of that, I would hold my arm through the vest with a treat. And he'd have to come through until his head was just under it. And he got a treat. And then after that, I'd pull it a little farther. And a little farther until he would stay with it hovering over him. I um, also learned he was afraid of the chest strap and the belly strap, so I got that taken care of. I know, you're so miserable, buddy. Um, and then I would have him go through it and then gently put the vest on him and just let it sit on him. Or put it on him and then take it off. And he got treats. Um, then would let it sit there for five seconds. And anytime he would move or shy away from it, I would take it off, tell him no, and we do it again. So learn that the vest is not a bad thing. We don't need to be afraid of it. So we're working on it, aren't we, bud? This is kind of my fault, too. I haven't trained him as much in the past year, <laughs> well, in the past few months, and it's, it's showing. But at least you could do your tasks good, huh, bud? Can you do your tasks good? He's like, Mom, leave me alone. So... Yeah, now I'm just gonna chill for a little while. I need to get my sheets washed. Lakota's coming to spend the night tonight, so yay! Um, so I need to get sheets washed and my blanket washed. And yeah, that's my Saturday afternoon. How's yours? Mm -hmm. 